Okay, so I want to touch up on something that has been going on for, I, I believe it's been three years. It's either been two years or three years now um, that the Packers have attempted to trade for Will Fuller or grab him. Uh, I believe this year he is a free agent. I believe he only had a one-year contract with the Miami Dolphins um, this year. Played in two games down here. We'll just move right down. Uh, he only played in two games with Miami this past year. Um, he would have played 2020, I believe, unless he got hurt. But he had a five-game suspension, so that's why he only played 11. But it would have been, uh, let's see, 16. Yeah, because <laughs> he just got to subtract one from now. So he would have played 16 if it wasn't for that suspension. I believe it was the first five games of the season that he was suspended here. Um, and so, you know, he's, he's a solid wide receiver, too, or whatever. Um you know, he can be used. I mean, I, did they use him as a wide receiver? One, no, because they had Hopkins. Never mind. Never, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say something. Never mind. Um, so you know, you, wide receiver two, wide receiver three option. You know, he's, he'd be pretty good. Three thousand total yards in his career here. Uh, two hundred thirteen receptions in uh, fifty five games. So uh, you know, not bad. Average fourteen yards. That's not. That's that's not bad. That isn't bad at all. <laughs> um. And then obviously, you know, rushing, I don't really want to talk about that. But what I want to talk about why I think they could potentially go be going for Will Fuller is because I found this. His punt return and kick return. Now, he didn't really do any, basically any kick returning uh, for the Texans. And again, maybe, maybe he would have done more if he played for Miami and didn't get hurt. Uh, but he only had two returns for 31 yards in 2016. I believe that's, what, his rookie year. So uh, they're probably just testing him out there. But... Punt returns, you see, obviously, 22 returns, 314 yards, averaging 14.3 there, his longest, um, longest total, so this is the total longest, 129, but longest 67-yard, uh, that, that was the touchdown, again, that's his rookie year, 49 here, uh, he did get two more attempts, um, this, uh, the 2020 season, maybe it would have been five or six if he wasn't suspended for, you know, those first five games here. Uh, but I sat and thought, our kick returner has basically been Amari Rogers, <laughs> and they've, they've thrown obviously they've thrown out a couple guys. They got um, we had someone for like a week who did a decent job, and then I think we cut him or whatever or something. Like I, I forget what happened last year, but we had a, like a better kick returner last year, and then we got rid of him. We had Tavon Austin two years ago um, for like three games and then i think did he get hurt he might have got hurt i think i don't remember um but i was looking at this and it's like okay you know obviously again he hasn't done it really anything since 2017 since you know he's younger and whatnot um but this could be why the packers could go for him so yes he can be a good wide receiver too wide receiver the as i stated before he could you know be a decent one um, but I think you could also put him back there to return punts. He's capable. He's done. He's done a uh, touchdown return or a punt, a kick return. Um, you know, so he's <laughs> averaging 15. A he averages 15 per per year in those two years. So um, I, I just thought, you know, that, that'd be interesting. Uh, it'd be very interesting just to see what he would do, how he would maybe help us, and maybe that's what the Packers thought of going after Will Fuller is is in again his earlier years in the league with the Texans he he, he did okay he he did decent for kick returning so maybe that's why they're going from so that's why I just want to make a quick video um on this because again they're going after him once again this year for the th uh, third time I believe um and I decided to look at his stats, and this kind of stood out to me. So, for now, like the video, share the video around, don't forget to subscribe, and I'm out of here. Peace.